as we heard in the report, it has not been easy at all. Up to today, we are still struggling. And in the front plains, as uh, you know, I don't know, you know about the history. As a community radio, uh, it was the people who contributed, you know, 50 pesos, 20 pesos. And we had to present a list of all the contributors to present to NCA that the radio does not belong to one person, it belongs to the community. So hairdressers, choba, charcoal sellers, everybody, 20 pesos, one CD, all their names we handed it to NCA for them to be convinced that it's really a community radio. And we started. And since it's a voluntary work, it is not very easy. It's not been easy for the workers, I mean, the volunteers. And we are still struggling even to renew our alliances. It's, not, it's a problem. As we speak now, you know, uh, we are negotiating with NCA, you know, for, to waive the fees for us so that we'll be able to renew our alliances. So these are issues, you know. It is only when you live among poverty you understand. Uh, if you live in Accra, you don't understand. But when you live in the interior, you, live, you see how people live, then you understand, you appreciate certain things. So the radio is actually serving very well for the people, especially the people in the interior who have no access to many, many things. As I always tell the people, there are many people who have never seen quota in the front place. They, 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 they have no idea. Some have not seen vehicle before, inside, interior. The front place is big. Uh, and it's not a five kilometer, it's very, very wide. So these are all problems that we are negotiating with NCA that even to extend you know, the coverage so that we can touch all the people who are inside the farming to feed the country. So community radio is playing a very big role, an important role in the development of our country. It is important that community radio serve as a tool to reach the people so that whatever government policy is, all of us we are supposed to put our hands on deck. But if the people inside it, the majority of the people live in the interior. If they have no access to this information, to, and also to educate them, to guide them, to accompany them to achieve, government will just be pouring water on rock. So I would think that government has to come in and to support, especially those communities who are still, you know, who have attended in their applications for a frequency. So they should be considered because they are playing a, a very important role in the development of the country. Thank you.